Let's take a look. Uh, winter storm watch has been uh, dropped. We are now under a winter weather advisory for the entire state. And that is uh, from uh, basically this late afternoon through early this evening. It's in effect right now for the immediate shoreline, but it goes into effect this evening. The timing's a little wonky. According to the National Weather Service, it's kind of all over the place. Just know there's a winter weather advisory in, in, in effect for the state through tomorrow morning. All right, our Channel 3 early warning dual pole radar. It's scanning dry right now, which is good news. There's more spotty showers through back through the south and west, and it's all trying to make its way into the state. All right, temperatures out there this morning, certainly cold cold enough to support this little bit of a mix precipitation. You'll notice the temperatures trend down and then they start going back up, but not by much at all today. I mean, we're talking about a 31 degree high, which is below average under mostly cloudy skies. You could see a few snow or mixed precipitation uh, showers by about one, two o'clock this afternoon. But basically it's negligible until tonight when the moisture really starts to kick in. The storm really ramps up tonight through early tomorrow morning, and then it's gone by about nine, 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. You'll notice a couple of showers for the shoreline, plain rain showers, but they might freeze on contact with the temperature of 33, especially in northern sections of our four southern counties. So you got to be careful as you move throughout the day today. If you see something wet today, pretend it's ice. That's all I'm going to say through tonight and into early tomorrow morning. All right, here are some more temperatures for you. We're in the upper 20s, low 30s. The winds are out of the northeast to 12 miles an hour. And that's making it feel a little bit colder. The temperature spread this morning between 17 and 27. So it certainly is cold enough out there for you. Mostly cloudy to start. Minimal freezing rain today. Minimal is the key word during the day today. And then rain and freezing rain possibly tonight. Uh, looks definite tonight through early tomorrow morning. So let's take a look at our regional radar. You can see we did have a little bit of precip in southeast Connecticut. I'm keeping my eyes on uh, northern New Jersey. You can see we've got some snow showers pushing through, even some mixed precipitation pushing through parts of northern New Jersey. This is all racing towards Connecticut, and it will be here within the hour. So get ready for some uh, snow and rain showers. Could even be a little bit of freezing rain out there. Here's early warning future cast. Tomorrow's weather today. Not a lot of spotty, spotty in nature as we move through noon and then spotty in nature through 3 p.m. And then the evening rush, we start to get a little hairy. All right, this is 5 p.m., okay? So you've got that uh, sleet and freezing rain coming down, snowflakes, raindrops, sleet. It's gonna be a plethora of precipitation types, but it could freeze on contact. And then overnight tonight through early tomorrow morning, that's when the storm really ramps up. We're taking a look at Northern Connecticut hanging onto the ice. This is icy conditions, and that's where we're gonna see that accumulation. And then it's all gone, nine o'clock, 10 o'clock tomorrow through noontime, it's pretty much winding down, which is good news. Here's what we're thinking. This is one model's estimate in terms of ice accumulations. Not a lot during the day today. Not a lot through early this evening, 5 o'clock. It's tonight through tomorrow morning we start to see that ice building in parts of northern Connecticut with as much as a quarter of an inch in Torrington, Enfield, a little bit more than that in Salisbury. Lighter amounts for the shoreline but ice accretion definitely expected to take place tonight through tomorrow morning in northern Connecticut. And this is where things can really get icy and dicey. All right, today's daytime highs pretty close to where they are right now. And then your seven day forecast includes uh, that early morning weather alert carries right on into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, we should start to see some gradual clearing. Wednesday looks good and then Thursday snow which could be heavy, changing over to freezing rain and plain rain by Friday morning. That's another messy storm. And then Saturday and Sunday looking good, but Monday another storm rolls in. Unbelievable.